Hi folks, I'm glad you're here with me this afternoon. It's Friday, May 3rd, 2024. And thank you very much for joining me. God bless you guys. Thank you so much for sharing my videos and your donations. You guys are just wonderful. Here we have an image of the East Rift Zone there at Kila Ea. Sorry for pronouncing it wrong. Yeah, if I heard it all the time, I probably would pronounce it right. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Here's another image of the East Rift Zone. Yeah, what a pretty picture, huh? Here we have an image of all the earthquakes that they've been having there on the big island of Hawaii. 1,032. They're saying since the 27th, there's been more than 1,600 earthquakes. And that was since April 27th. So I don't know what the real count is. They were initially concentrated beneath the upper east rift zone along a chain of craters. And some of them I have marked out here on uh, Google Earth. Approximately 300 more earthquakes uh, that were located near Halemamu Crater, which is up over here, in the boundaries of Kilaea Caldera. Most of the earthquakes have been smaller than a magnitude 2, located at a depth between 2 and 4 kilometers, which would be between 1 and 2 miles. But they're getting shallower here. You can see 1.0 miles. There was, okay, this one here is a minus. 0, 0.0 miles. What that means is that earthquake was above sea level because all earthquakes are measured from sea level. Um, let's light that up right there. Right there by volcano it says. We got uh, 0 0.8, 1.1. Um, that one's 1.3. We'll come down and take a look. The more recent ones looks like well, here's one that's uh, minus 0 0.2 miles. That was a magnitude 2.6, and that was today. There has been 70 earthquakes so far today. This 3.0, that might be the largest one, uh, 0 0.6 miles. And USGS put out a image of all the earthquakes between April 22nd and May 2nd. That was yesterday. And this is the location where the majority of those earthquakes have been occurring. When I did my report a couple days ago, I showed how the tilt meter was rising up. Well, now it looks like it's slightly going down. Now, this is in um, micro rads. That's as big as I can make it. Well, I could probably make the page larger. Let me try that. There you go. They're saying that there was a larger earthquake on the 27th, a magnitude 3.3. Um, not a big difference between today's 3.0. The pattern of the ground motion and tilt show that the magma bodies beneath the southern end of Kalipeli, sorry for pronouncing that wrong, which is the southern end of the crater. I don't know if it's going to take me. Okay, they got the trail. Um, but it's not going to take me to the exact location. Back in October of last year, uh, that's when the magma chamber started to grow. And then they believe that it drained out and started feeding into the um, East Rift Zone area. So if you can picture the plumbing system of um, the big island of Hawaii, yeah, it probably comes up through here and then travels to the east. All right, I have another image for you, which means more likely a crack opened up that had probably previously sealed from its last eruption there in the east rift zone. So now it's traveling eastward under the ground, and it's probably just going to be a matter of time before it erupts again. This image here on Google Earth is from uh, February 28th of this year, and you can see all these um, past lava flows. So the magma chamber there has been recharging for about two months. And I thought it was interesting of this image here of the East Rift Zone. I just refreshed it. And this one, which is probably closer to the floor of the 
area or the ground of the area. Yeah, a lot of difference. You can see the haze over the east rift zone. Um, it refreshed at 9.55 a.m. Hawaii time. Currently 75 degrees there. I bet you it's muggy. I know the local population has felt a lot of these earthquakes. For today's 3.0, 14 people did send in reports to USGS that they felt it. Intensity level 3, not too bad. Kind of overlapping the mountain view area. What do we got here? Volcano 3, Volcano 2, um, 3 there, 4 reports there, 1 report there, and 9 reports to the north. Yeah, you just don't know what God's got planned or when it's going to erupt again. Um, but everyone is aware of that. That's what you get for living in such a beautiful location, right? So what are your thoughts? Put your comments down below. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for sharing my videos. Thank you very much for your generous support. God bless you guys. Please stay safe. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you all. Bye.